Montana, I mean, we know society is putting pressure on women to have children. So did you personally have a lot of pressure from your family? You know, my family was actually really supportive. It was people outside of that that weren't as supportive of my choice. So I, I, you know, I have talked to people who who want permanent birth control and their family absolutely was like, no, I want a grandchild. (laughs) So that was kind of, but my my family was really supportive of it, especially my mom. She respected it 100%, you know, because motherhood is not easy. It's hard. Yes, it is. No doubt about that. So Dr. Curry, you're childless by choice. Do you have any advice for women who want to be child free, but feel pressured from society and are sort of trapped? The main message I want to send to women is trust yourself to any person. Trust yourself. If you have known for years that something was right for you. When I was a kid, I never played house. I never played wedding stuff. I never played with baby dolls. I carried around my dad's medical kit and that was it. I mean, that's where it ended. Did you have people sit on a, lie down on a couch and you talk to them? (laughs) I was a, I was a pretty much flunky. I had to switch gears, but I knew I wanted to do something in the helping profession. I knew that it needed to feel significant. It needed to be truly meaningful. And I found that my life is so full. Sometimes I joke with my clients. I'm like, I feel like I'm in the movie 13 going on 30. I wake up and I'm like, look in my closet. Look at my job. Look at my friends. Every day is a wonder. And for people who are considering being child free, I really want to empower you to trust yourself. And we can counteract that fearful negative thinking that holds us back from the things that would truly make us feel most alive by taking stock of all the things we can be grateful for. So take stock of what's there. Be grateful for what you have. Keep your focus on that. If you ever feel like you're being weighed down by the regrets or the worries, seek professional help. But other than that, ladies, trust yourselves. All right. Ladies, thanks for all your insight. Dr. Curry, Dr. Manaya, Dr. Putnam, thank you so much in Montana. Thanks for being such an advocate and spokesperson. A pleasure having you all. Thank Thank you. Thank you.